and rally. Oh, he's been spotted on the ground and maximum. Well, the bowling so far has been a case study in miserly work. And this one, well, this was a just a dolly. Another HBL 6, 143 across the tournament. Remembering 20,000 rupee donated to charity for every hit, six hit. And this was much needed. And that Yorker between the crease and the stumps. How far can they get? How much can they put on the board? Probably going to need about 150. I think that's in the game. Riley Russo. Well, he's just picked it up. And it's flown away. HBL Tournament 6 is 144. Another 20,000 rupees. Go loot low. Donation. Well, this is almost rude, this stroke. This is almost a regulation sweep shot. Should have picked up the cue. Short habit. What a shot that is. Well, that ball just sat up beautifully with an invitation. Young bowler, well, I think he's a little bit rattled. Starting to lose his way of fraction. Being bullied at the moment by Riley Rousseau. Absolutely nailed that. He's hit bang in the centre of the change-up is the faster delivery, normal delivery. Again, the slow one, but this time it's the reverse sweep, played to perfection, ends the 30 in Round the wicket has then. Down the track and boy, out of here. That is massive. Riley Rousseau has picked that beautifully. Another HBL tournament six, 145 now. And this was one of the bigger ones. Pace on, oh no. Did roll the fingers on that a little bit, but not a big enough change in pace. And Riley Rousseau looking dangerous. 92 metres, that last hit, and he wants more. 41 off 20. Where does Asnan go now? Drives the Yorker, goes to the fence again at that. Well, if I was the captain, I'd be going up to my young bowler and saying, what has worked for everybody else? It's been pace off the ball. I don't care how you do it. You bowl as slow as you possibly can on this next delivery. If you're rightly Rousseau, you're just thinking, fill your boots. Four or six, whatever he bowls here, I'm going. 70 now. Cutting with the slow one, and he just gets it over. Shane Watson, young Shane Watson, tries to jump up in the air, doesn't work. 50. Riley Russo, just 23 deliveries. Three maximums in that. What an imposing 50. And this innings just keeps getting better and better. This time the little paddle. Again, slower ball from Ben Cutting. Fortunately, Riley Rousseau, he got enough of it. Side fence. 
smashes it through the offside. Russo is just playing with the bowling. And they shuffled around the field. It's made no difference. Unique field in T20 cricket. Four men inside the circle from cover around a short third man. Not much he can bowl there. Bowl the slower ball into the pitch again. And look how much movement Riley Rousseau has shown around the crease. Well played. Special innings continues. Point pass. Whipped away. Another boundary. Four boundaries off the over. 102. Bit of a uh, steady eddy. He's 21 from 20. Been pretty much a spectator from the other end watching Rousseau cut loose time for Nassim Shah who's been laced into the covers and he does get it through they're dealing in boundaries here for the Multan Sultans well things are getting out of hands Danny Goita has got to do something about it these two batsmen are just hitting at their will it was Riley Rasu earlier, now Ashan has decided to take on. What a hitting. Trying to close down in a different angle. Racing. Answer. Now, has this been saved? We're going to have to probably come upstairs and just have a look if this has been saved from the boundary. Yeah, the effort was good. Full marks to the effort. And I'm not really sure that this, I think he's touching the rope when he's pulled the ball back into play. There's Mohammed Nawaz, one of the best fielders in Koida Gladiators, couldn't really pull it back. Four more. Yeah, I'm with you, just there. Yeah, hands on it. Momentum. Very difficult to stop that. Signal. Well, the way they're going, Danny, I, I don't see any reason. Well, they won't touch at least 190. 12 and over is very much possible here. And uh, this man can do it. 64 of 30 deliveries. Exceptional. Yeah, there we go. There we go. It's gone all the way again. 100 partnership between these two. 148 for three. And batter of clash. This is quite a solid clash. I think the skipper was looking where he hit it, wasn't watching because he's just admiring his stroke play because he got it so sweet. This has disappeared very quickly. Yeah, room there once again for Shan Masood. He wasn't really looking. Both of them are looking at the ball. Sohail was hoping that this will not go to the boundary, and Shan Masood. Was hoping that it'll go, and there you go. I pushed him a little bit, but that's okay. Slower one, put it in, host this on it. Yeah, it's out of here. Marvelous striking again from Riley Rousseau. Crowd right royally entertained here. We all thought that this pitch might play a little slow, it'll be hard to hit away. Not for Riley Russell. Slower one. And hit it hard, high and handsome. That's gone. Out of here. What a hitting. His fifth maximum. There's a little change up. Guess what? That's four more. Ends the over 19 of the 17th. It's 167 for three here. Right. 
Shams finding his feet too. You've got the artistry of Shah Massoud not trying to bosh it and bludgeon it. He'll leave that to Riley Rousseau. He's now into the 40s nicely, Massoud. Very calm, Shah Massoud. No real rush into that stroke. A genuine cover drive on that full toss. The timing was short deliveries. This is not going to work. Not at all. Don't worry about chasing that. That's gone between the two fielders, cover and mid-off. That's gone quickly. Yeah, I was just watching Safras there too, once that went through cover. He just turned his back and looked back towards us in our commentary position. Missed the length again. Young man, he's having one of those days on the learning curve. Missed his Yorker, missed the length. Rousseau didn't. Another four to Riley, who's now 85 from 35. Striking, well, let's call it 243. And the leading run scorer in the season so far. Oh! Moose me, baby, and he obliges! Oh, yes! 17 off that one. 184 for three here. Coaches here in the HBL PSL. Oh, there, a little bit of cramping possibly. Been there a while and he's um, fatted a few. 9 4 6 6 is Riley Rousseau. There's the change up, and that's a wicket. Finally, there's a bit of change of pace and a change of luck and fortune for the Gladiators. Well, that's what I meant when I said try to bowl those short deliveries. If the fuller delivery is not working, go for the short one. Wicket. Very rare wicket for Koita Gladiator. Broken the partnership. But this man is still out there, struggling with his foot. Bounced a little bit and couldn't really go over the top. Easy catch, simple catch. There for the fielder. To hail Khan. And he's just been spanked. Oh, yes. Riley, you ripper. He's moved to 98 from 41. Well, this pace is not going to harm him. He's faced Nassim Shah. He's faced Snan. So Hail Khan is a lot slower. That's why he's used his feet. Got to the pitch. Although from Riley Rousseau. Here we go. In the air. In the air. Somebody's going to catch it. Batsman's cross. Riley Rousseau will be facing. Yeah, good stuff and away from Kustal Shah. He knew he had to get Riley Rousseau back on strike or six and out. Did the right thing for the team. Has to pop back to the pavilion yeah, and off the blade and, uh, down the throat in the end of uh, Anwar Ali. Yeah, very important to see them actually cross. Riley was very crowd are on their feet here because Riley Rousseau is one away, he's 99 from 42. Sahail. Nicely bowled, but there's a great hundred. Fastest ever in the PSL. You better believe it, buddy. HBL PSL, fastest hundred. It's the seventh in the history of the HBL PSL. And by Jingo, it's the fastest. No surprises there. Cameron Delport got 100 last year in 